soccer is a unique sport establishing bases around the globe, welcoming more to the plate. It's called beep baseball. Baseball for the visually impaired, requiring athletes to acquire the, uh, the skills of timing and listening. And I caught up with one Chicago beat baseball player on his story and how this sport is inspiring many to live a meaningful life. Take a look. I play for the Chicago Comets. It's for uh, individuals who are blind or visually impaired. I've been kind of playing what we call a rover, which in essence is a deep left position. So beat baseball um, has the same intent as the game of baseball that we associate with, you know, the American pastime um, with a few additional uh, modifications or the pitcher is on your team and they pitch to you. The bases are 100 feet away instead of 90 feet away. Um, there's first base and there's third base. And so when a runner hits the ball, um, they will run to one of the buzzing bases. Um, as a hitter, you are not aware of which base will go off. It'll be either be first or third. And the baseball is there are four strikes. There's only one ball. Sometimes maybe our timing is off and some people might take a ball and just kind of like listen for the pitch to go by in a game. The ball beeps as well um, to indicate to the fielders, um, uh, you know, where it is on the field. As a hitter, um, you listen to the pitcher's cadence. So a pitcher will always, a good pitcher will always have the same cadence. And so you work at keeping your swing in the same place every time. So he'll say something such as, you know, set, ready, pitch. So the next time he says it, he has to say it the same way. Set, ready, pitch. And we time it depending on who's pitching um, of when our hands are gonna come through the zone. So in a game, the ball will beat bullies. But for our practices, it, will not, it won't beat. It's also helped with camaraderie. Um, in a sense of interacting with other people who kind of share the same experiences as me in life. Um, and this goes for also like anyone who's visually impaired and uh, maybe younger um, or may have lost their vision recently. Um, I know I've talked to people and they've said for them it's helped with um, interacting with people who are blind and vision impaired who may, you know, who have careers, who have families. Um, you know, I have a girlfriend and a little boy, so, you know, so for them to know that, you know, life with blindness is possible. I was born visually impaired. It's a uh, condition called microophthalmia. Um, in English, it means small eyes. Um, and basically what happened in essence is the eyes did not develop properly in the womb. And so I was born totally blind, yes. No light, nothing. That visual impairment doesn't stop, you know, you from engaging in athletics or sports or any kind of, uh, I mean, and, and that goes for life too, you know, any kind of dream you want to pursue. That camaraderie and that uh, helping people understand that you know, they can do something, you know, with their lives. So many inspiring individuals that are stepping up to the plate. Rich says that beat baseball has a huge impact reminding players of their value and purpose that can still live a meaningful life oh, despite absolutely. visual impairment. Yes, Very they cool. look super successful yes. out there too. Yeah, that's cool. Well, if you would like to support this sport or learn more about how you or a loved one can get involved as a player or coach, we'll connect you with everything you need to know over at CILiving.tv.